So here we have a look of all the products that Terence and I are gonna use this year 2021 for our personal care. And yes, there is a lot of products dedicated to me. And like Terrence said, my cut down of all these products. But hey, it takes money, money to be a woman. And I said, don't complain because always can be worse. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I might have to watch out, but I think I'm doing pretty good. Uh, let's start over here. It's my hair products. Last year and these years, I've been using Pantene Pro-V. And I like how I list my hair. I also have this brand, Fructis Garnier. Garnier, Fructis, I think is the name of the brand. Or just Garnier. I'm not sure. But I like um, this brand too. And these products, norm normally the big containers and everything are from Costco. You're familiar for Co from, uh, with Costco. And they they sell like big containers of things. So here we have um, the conditioner and shampoos. I have already two more, condi one conditioner and one shampoo that I already have in the house that I'm using. Normally I use two conditioners and two shampoos for the year, more or less. These big ones um, normally at 10 bucks, but after the, I think it's $2.5 off, I normally get them from... Um, $7.5 and these small ones I think I got them for four dollars each I don't remember from where I got them and uh, from here we have um, the mask for my hair and I used them already these same ones last year and I liked how they leave my hair and this is the avocado one. This is the one that I'm currently using. Normally one of these, it lasts me for six months. So I got two of these and I got them on sale for $3 each. I think they were, they were six or $7. The container are 10 ounces, not 10 ounces each. Um, I also got this um, argan oil, I use it, I put it on my hair, on my face, or sometimes even on my body, but it mostly for my hair and for my face, and when I use it for my hair, I put it on before, for a while, like a few hours before I, I wash my hair. This thing for four ounces cost me $15. Actually, this one I got it on Amazon, and I like it as well. Obviously, why would I say that? If I didn't like it, I wouldn't buy it. But I mean, I guess sometimes you buy things that you think you're going to like them, but then you don't like them. I guess that's why I'm saying that. Um, this is the um, a Titango product, five ounces. This, I believe, is um, under $6, 5.79 or something like that. Now I cut my hair a lot, but I used to have my hair above my hips. So this product was very useful. Also, Terrence for a while had an afro, so he was using this as well. But I used this, um, these two products last me for the entire year. Again, it's for detangle the hair, nothing special there. This is um, to massage my head. On 2018, I have a lot of stress and that caused me hair loss. So I got this thing to massage uh, my hair loss. Um, I got it actually, I think at the end of last year, I didn't know about this thing. The thing is that um, I noticed for uh, since 2018, that my hair was, I was losing my hair and I was just getting worried about it. So, of course, I did, you know, um, all the route that you need to go to check if you have any problem for your hair loss. And then when you realize it's just because you're stressed and things like that, then, of course, you take care of your stress. But I try to do things like this to help that kind of thing. 
and also medication and things like that. Um, oh, this product is for dyeing my hair. I use this brand, Revlon. I think I've been using it for the last two or three years. I go between black and dark brown. My hair is dark brown, but I like both. So I, I think every six, uh, nine weeks, I put the product on, on my hair and it looks pretty much the same in my head. I mean, maybe obviously the black look, looks a little bit darker, but mostly I get the same result. These are under $3, $2 and 60 something. And I think I got those, um, they sell them mostly at the same price at Target and Walmart. And okay, over here I have face cream. Terrence really like this uh, face cream and he put it on his face. He also, when he um, cut his hair to zero, I don't know if that's how you say it in English, but anyways, when he cut it to zero, so he's African-American and Sometimes when uh, he doesn't have to go to see clients for a while, uh, he can stay home and I love him having an afro, <laughs> but normally his hair is at zero. So he put this um, on his head, like all over his head to moisturize it and things like that. I don't know, he like it. And my girl Skylar love to lick his face <laughs> when he, he put this thing on. This is 3.27. This thing right here, it lasts him for the entire year. It's 15 ounces. And me, for my face, I like this one. This is 6.7 ounces. It's a little bit more expensive. I don't remember right now. Let me see. Oh, 3.68. So they're mostly the same price, but this have, have the... Uh, the amount so i like to put this for my face but also i do coconut oil i do coconut oil basically for everything i could remove all the lotions and all these products for the face and the body because coconut oil is pretty good for me i put it on my hair as a hair mask put it under my eye for the uh, dark circles I put it on my elbows, everywhere. Very good. This is actually from Costco. It's $14. It's a very large container. It's 84 ounces. And this lasts me... Ah, I mean, I also use it for cooking. Um, <laughs> a lot of uses for this. This container can last me easily for two years. Because I think I got it... Uh, September of last year um, and it's still like over here or something so probably I'm not gonna need to buy more until next year um, we are here okay so here for let's finish the face this mask is for my face this is like six dollars and something and these are three dollars and something uh, they're six ounces each and I got four because I have one more of this in the in the front house and with these four I probably gonna have for the entire year I use one or twice um, a week and sometimes when Terrence doesn't doesn't see me I sneak one mask on his face <laughs> uh, over here I think I was over here so like I said this is for uh, my face mask and here is um, the uh, face scrub, we both use this as well. This is uh, the Kroger, is the the uh, Ralph's brand, I believe. I like this one more than the one that is next to this one. I don't remember saying uh, Ives. I don't know how you pronounce it. I like this one because it has more um, grain. I don't know if that's the proper, oh, look. It says compared to Saint Ives, Ives. I don't know how you pronounce it, but anyways, I like this one. It has more grain on it, so if you like um, a scrub with more grain, this is uh, yours. If you like a little bit softer, the other one is um, 
is uh, good for you. The price, this one is $3, but I normally get them on sale, and on sale is $2.49. And the, the name brand, I think it is like three something. So it's not really about the price, it's more about the quality of the product. Uh, for my taste, I like that one more. And, oh, let's over here. Here is, uh, how you call this thing? Um, let me put the camera there. Antipath Eye Roller. I use under my eyes either that one or, again, coconut oil. Either one. I saw a product in, uh, in Amazon that I liked, but it's uh, out of order. But I might get it. But so far, I'm happy with my coconut oil under my under my eyes too. So for now, I'm gonna use this too. This is um, eight dollars. And to finish with my face, let's uh, move over here. I have uh, Dove. I use this for washing my face in the morning and at night time. I have five. I'm already using one. So probably I'm going to have some leftovers of those. But I really like the brand for um, my face, even for the body. But I find that a little bit more difficult to use this for your body. kind of like this product more for the body. Um, over here I have this brand, Clean and Clear. When I put makeup on, okay, and when I do my makeup, I basically just cover my um, dark circles. And I have... Um, Pearls uh, coloring thing. I don't know how you call it. Yeah, I think you call them coloring pearls to just give some color to my face because I'm extremely milk color at this moment. But that's basically what I do. And I use, I think, mascara, that's the name for your eyelashes. And then when I do that, uh, I use this product to wash my face. But I need to learn more about makeup. <laughs> I don't know much about it. At my age, I still don't know much about it. I need to get um, to learn a little bit more, so maybe I can more of the products that normally women use for the face. But for me, since I don't use much makeup, this one works enough. And this I like to use it at, at the end when I wash my face and everything. I like to get a cut and a square and just do the last layer. I got this one in Trader Joe's. I don't remember, I think it was $11, that container. I'm looking here and this is my paper with all the prices, $11. And by the way, don't worry because um, either at the beginning of the video or at the end of the video, I uh, will show you an Excel sheet with all the prices and everything so you can take a look at it. So that's... Uh, the last product that I, I use in my face. And over here, well, the other end, we all know the other end. I have uh, five more of these. Well, I mean, now four in the house. Last year, I bought four containers of five packs. So I, I bought 20, and it's more than we use there. And I share the other end, so we we'll use the same brand. I think it's silly <laughs> for us to use. I used to use Dove, but I'm not a big fan of the other one, that brand. I kind of like how I smell Degree or Gillette, so we use the same one. And uh, I think we're going to have one pack left uh, over for this year as well. But um, this one, this was $13 before the discount at Costco, and this was $15 uh, before the discount, uh, Costco, I think the discount was $4. Um, basically, it's the same price because this is, um, the container of this one is 3.8 ounces and the contain, and this one is actually 2.7. So if you do the math, it's basically the same, the same price, more or less. And this, even though it's at the other end, I, I asked Terrence if he can use it every day as a cologne. Because I really like the smell. And he doesn't like cologne. Um, barely use cologne. But, oh man, 
<clears throat> I don't know, it's uh, because I'm from Spain. I'm used to all the men there. They shower in their colognes, but <laughs> I miss some cologne on him. So he said, okay, I compromise with this. And I said, fine, let's compromise with that. I think it was um, $3, I think it cost us that one. I'm not sure. It smells very good. This, uh, I don't know if there is more uh, smells. This is something called Kilo. All right, so that there over here, this is uh, from Costco. The two of them are nine bucks, but they have, I think, $3 off. And this is the one that we use for our hands. I have a very cute container that I got last year from Costco. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I just refilled them with uh, this brand. I like how it smells. Over here we have, uh, this is from the, this is the a store brand from Target. I've been using it already. This is the third year and I, I like it very much. I think they said it compares to Dove. It really is irrelevant if it compares or not, if you like it. So I got three of these and three of this color. This is deep moisturizing and that one is sensitive skin. I, I just bought them because I like the smell of the two of them. I already have two in the in the house. I'm probably gonna have leftovers of this one as well. And these were six dollars for the two of them. <clears throat> Excuse me, three dollars for the two of them. But all the stuff that I got at Target, I have um, a discount of almost eleven dollars, which was all of these, all of these, and I think all of these. And all these products have $11 discount. So I don't know exactly how the discount was divided. But everything, all the mouthwashes, the body lotions, and the deep moisturizer have $11 off. And in total, I think I paid $41. Which, uh, when I did the math, it was it was good. Um, over here we have Tampax and... Pads, I think you call these pads. Yeah, pads. They, these are both from Costco. I got, I, I buy them normally um, when they are three or four dollars off. I think this was uh, ten dollars and this is eleven dollars. Normally, these are I like to use them the first and the last day of my period, and this one in the middle. Normally, it lasts me for like three or four days. I'm fortunate in that in that uh, area that it comes regularly every month, 28 days, and it lasts um, three or four days. So here we have some leftovers from last year. So I think this is gonna cover the entire year. Um, ah, and I, there is no tax on this, because I've been checking on the tax on everything, and I don't think there is tax on these products, only these products, I think. Uh, over here we have, Petroleum jelly, I think it's also, is bas Vaseline, no? I use Vaseline or petroleum jelly, I think it's the same. For my feet, the ankle, no, the, where, I don't know how you call the, the heel, the heel. It gets um, a little bit rough because I like to wear uh, uh, slippers all the time. So I use it for um, for that. Uh, for the heel and also for my elbows and sometimes even you know I put it on my tattoos and stuff but oh and when I do my hair dyeing I also put it around my face so my face doesn't get uh, dyed as well because <laughs> oh man sometimes I forget about it and it takes forever to get the dye out of my face especially my ears mm. No oh, nice. This lotion is um, the um, Up and Up brand. I really like it. Tennis doesn't like it, but me, oh, man, let me go down to memory line for a moment. And this remind me of of my summer house where we used to go there uh, all summer when you're young. You're so fortunate to be able to go with your parents to the beach and uh, it smelled like 
it just it brings me so many many good memories um tennis personally i don't think he likes coconut or cocoa or, or this kind of smells he doesn't like much but i do and it's uh because it says butter <clears throat> it's like thick i really like it and uh, i already have um i got a nivea too because nivea is one of my favorites for body lotions but i wanted to try this brand and i'm very pleased with this when i finish with the nivea i i'll use this one nivea also brings me a good memory so my juice because that's a brand that we use at home i think sometimes we smells bring all these beautiful memories and then you want to you know keep those memories i remember when my mother passed away one of the things i noticed and i missed i keep smelling her clothes because i knew i knew eventually that smell was gonna be gone forever and that was tough oh Let's don't get teary in here, but let's say mm, smells um, are important for us, right? This, all these smells that bring good memories to our lives. Um, here, I got three of these. They're $1. I actually got this in the 99 cent store, and I really like them. I really like to like scrub properly my entire body when I'm taking a shower. And... Terence doesn't like them, so that's why I don't get them for him. But for me, I do. And I change them every three or four months. So, actually, four months if I have three. And very good. One dollar each. This is actually... I didn't buy this. This is a present. And these are the typical... Um, lip? I think you call them lip balm? Yeah, lip ba balm. I have another one, Nivea, also I think I have it here, that I'm currently using. I like this one very much, this is my favorite, but I like the brand too. Probably this, it might be around $10 or something like that if you buy it. So I think we have enough turns and I for this year with this thing. And over here, oh, I wanted to show you this, this is another present. This is a... Uh, oils i don't know much about oils but man they smell good this one clean mask is my favorite and inside the container they have like a paper that it tells you like different mixes that you can do like this different mixes and they smell very good i mean me personally i wouldn't spend like 30 bucks on buying these things but I, the person gave it to me is uh, very generous and I'm very blessed that she gave me this and introduced me to something that I didn't know much about it. So um, at nighttime, I like to put this on my wrist or behind my ear and it smells super, super good. Just a, a tiny bit of this smell like for a long time. Mouthwash, I got uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Uh, six of them. I actually have one uh, in the main house still from last year. So I bet we're going to have some leftovers. This is also from um, Up and Up brand and it's $3 for 1.3 liters. I'm sorry, uh, 50.7 ounces. I just made a video in Spanish. So I was doing liters. <laughs> And over here we have Kleenex. I got this uh, at Costco. They were $4.5 off. I think they were $19.5 before the discount. And with this, we're going to have the entire year. Uh, back here we have uh, the Kirkland brand. It's my favorite for um, tissue, bath tissue. And we got 120 rolls, which I think is Four package of obviously cuatro por tres doce. So it's four package of thirty rolls each. I'm only showing you one because it doesn't <laughs> fit me more here. But just I had an idea. Actually, I think it's around seventy dollars because each container is seventeen. So I think 
in total we spend 67 point something, almost $70 in toilet paper. It's a lot of money. I mean, almost $100 between Kleenex and toilet paper. And it's only two people. I can only imagine when we have uh, children, how much we're going to spend on these things. Ay, Dios mío, de mi vida, de mi corazón. Anyways, toilet paper. I got to say, this is the second year that I do it. So it was very useful yesterday and uh, last year when we have this uh, shortage of this product that I already have it and didn't have to stress out about that. <laughs> um, and last but not least, yes. Um, bucal hygiene, you would call this thing? Yeah, I think it's bucal hygiene. We have tooth brushes. This is $15, but I always buy it at Costco on sale and it's uh, $5 off. So this lasts us for the entire year. Tennis has been looking to um, electrical brushes, but still we are not decided. So we're going to keep using this. And then we have, uh, this is a brand that I like, Colgate. I don't know how you say in English, Colgate. I'm not sure how you pronounce this. But um, so I bought two of these. They are eight ounces and it's two dollars. But Costco has this brand, Crest Complete, and it's eight point two ounces each container. I think these were um, thirteen dollars before the offer. I have here my the price. So yeah, it was thirteen dollars before the the sale, and the sale were four dollars, so it was nine dollars for the five of these. Um, I think it's going to be fine. I mean, toothpaste is toothpaste, right? Um, <clears throat> I, I This is my favorite because it's the one that I use my entire life. So I bet this is going to be fine too. And this is Minty Fresh Strip. Stripe? Stripe? Maybe it's a stripe. Anyway, so we're probably going to have maybe one of these leftovers for the year. And then last is this. I didn't put it in the amount of this year because I bought them last year and the container comes with six. So I use uh, three last year and I have uh, three more for this year. I already have one in the main house. This one is like broken or something and it bothers me. I don't know why that it doesn't close up. But anyway, so this is everything. And I believe... Um, out of the almost $400, so it was 354 plus 10% of tax that I calculate. It's around $4,400. I believe around between $30 and $50 we are not going to be using. I'll say probably at the end of this year. I'm calculating that two of these... It's already ten dollars each, right? Two of these are we're gonna have leftovers, probably at least one of these, probably one or two of these, maybe one container of these, and maybe one or two of these. I think the rest will just everything. Things that you by the way, you're not seeing here, like um cottons or q tips and things like that. Uh, we barely use them. I use the Q-tips for the dog's ears and, um, the cotton or the, or the squares, cottons for my face. I get them actually at the 99 cent store and it lasts me, I don't know, maybe I buy one or two. So it's minimum the expense that I have on those things. But this is basically the bulk of everything to get you a, a general idea of everything that we spend in this house. I believe this is everything and I want to say thank you for watching my video. If you like it, press the button that says like and subscribe. Uh -huh.